On Monday, October 23, a dense superfog in Louisiana, a combination of fog and wildfire smoke, resulted in a massive multi-car pileup on Interstate 55 near New Orleans. The incident led to at least seven deaths and dozens of injuries, as more than 150 vehicles were involved in the catastrophic collision. Super fog is a weather phenomenon that occurs when smoke and moisture from damp, smoldering organic material, such as leaves and brush, mix with cool, moisture-laden air. The particles from the smoke attach to water molecules, producing a thicker fog that can significantly reduce visibility to less than 10 feet. It typically occurs in areas with light winds, making it particularly hazardous when present over highways. Super fog is a technical term officially used by meteorologists to describe conditions that are more enhanced than typical fog. It differs from smog, which is caused by man-made pollutants, such as vehicle emissions and industrial dust. While Louisiana is considered a wetland state, marshes can dry out, particularly during droughts. This dryness can lead to wildfires in marshes and timberland. These fires, often caused by factors like lightning strikes, controlled burns for wildlife management, or human activity, can smolder and produce smoke for weeks or months. Climate change may contribute to an increased frequency of such fires. Louisiana is currently under burn bans in order to reduce the amount of fire smoke in the air, and to minimize the risk of further super fog. Forecasters warn that anyone driving in foggy conditions should slow down, allow extra time to reach a destination, and ensure the vehicle is visible using low beam headlights and tail lights. High beam headlights should never be used as the light causes glare and makes it more difficult for drivers to see what is ahead of them on the road, according to NWS. Drivers should also always leave extra distance from the person in front of them and follow the lines of the road with their eyes. In cases of extremely dense fog, where visibility is near zero, drivers are advised to turn on hazard lights and stop in a safe location. If none are available, drivers are advised to pull off the road and turn on hazard lights. You have been watching Disaster Relay. Like and subscribe for more.